Hello, Chapalochitas. My name is Mrs. Parker and I am your school librarian. I'm here to help with a serious problem. What do you do when you've finished all of your library books, but you're not going to get to the library again anytime soon? We've all been there, but don't worry. I'm here to help. Did you know that Chapalo has a collection of ebooks that you can read online anytime? Ebooks are electronic or digital books. Pretty cool, huh? In this video, you're going to learn how to use ebooks at Chapelo so that you can enjoy reading anytime. You'll learn how to find Chapelo's ebooks online, choose an ebook that is right for you, and use some ebook features so that you can enjoy your book. Ready? First, you need to go to our Chapelo website. After you take a moment to admire photos of the school and your friends, scroll down a tiny bit you will see an icon that looks like, you guessed it, a book. It says District 6 Library Book Search. Click on it. This takes you to Destiny Discover, our catalog, which is where you can see every item our library owns. To use eBooks, you need to log in. Click on Log In at the upper right corner of the screen. If you know your username and student number or lunch number from school, you can use that to log in, but if you don't know or remember it, just type Chapelo, all lowercase, into both fields. Take a minute to look at what we've recently added to our library, then scroll down a bit to see our collection of eBooks. On the right side of the eBooks ribbon, it says, see all 91. If you click that, you will see a list of all of Chapelo's eBooks. You can browse the whole list to see what looks good to you, or you can narrow your search using the filters on the left. Filters let you see only the kinds of books you want while hiding the ones you don't want. Look at some of the filters. You can search for books by a certain author, subject, genre, or even accelerated reader level. Whenever you add or remove a filter, you will see the books that match what you have chosen here in the middle of the screen. I'm going to sort using the accelerated reader filter, and I'm going to choose books that fall between 2.0 and 3.9 accelerated reader level. If I click on this choice, I will see all of the books that match that choice in the middle of the screen now. If you want to remove a filter, you can close it by clicking the X next to the filter. Now we're seeing all of Chaplow's eBooks again. I'm going to look at the book Score by Mary Kate Doman. I can click on the picture of the book cover or on the title to see more information about the book along with other eBooks that are similar that I might enjoy. To open the eBook, click Open. Your book will open in a new browser tab. You will see the cover of the book here in the middle of the page. You will see icons at the top of the screen that will help you adjust settings to enjoy the book more. Along the bottom, you'll see a progress bar that tells you how many pages are in the book as well as which page you are currently viewing. Let's click on the capital and lowercase a's at the top. This opens up the display options for your book. Here, you can zoom in or out, change how the book fits on the screen, or adjust the background color. You can play with the settings until you like how it looks or change them at any time. I'm going to make it so I can see two pages at once, like a print book, and change the background to black. Be careful, if you want to see the whole page at once, you have to choose fit to height. Close the display options window, and now click where it says book at the top of the page. This gives you a list of helpful choices. If you want to search for a word or a phrase in the book, look at the table of contents, or learn more information about the ebook. If you're logged in with your student ID, you will see more options here, such as a bookmark or a notebook feature. You can take a look at these if you like, but when you're ready to start reading this book, click the arrow at the right side of the page. This will turn the page. If you need to go back to, to a previous page, click the left arrow. 
Now, if you are logged in with your student ID, you will have the option to check an ebook out. And that way it will be available to only you for two weeks. However, if you just want to read it without checking it out, that's fine too. You can just close the browser tab when you're finished reading for now. Remember, if you want to find ebooks online, go to Chapelo's website and click on District 6 Library Book Search. Log yourself into Destiny Discover and then click on See All 91 to see our ebooks. Use the filters to find the ebooks that you want to read. Click on the A icon to change the display settings for your book. Enjoy reading your book online anytime. Well, that's it. Enjoy browsing Chapelo's online ebooks. If you have any questions or need help, just let me know. You know where to find me in the middle of a great book. <laughs>